Hey guys, what is going on? Lego Man One Two, and welcome back to another video. Where, as you can see, we are in a different location for today's video, and that is because today's video will be about recreating the Harry Potter Triwizard Tournament task to the Black Lake by using the Lego Harry Potter Triwizard Tournament, the Black Lake set seven six four two zero. And what I would like to do for today's video is have the bottom half of the set look like it's underwater, whilst the top half isn't very similar to how the movie does portray this scene in the Goblet of Fire. So in this set you do get 5 minifigures as well as an additional character which is present throughout the scene this set is based on. And they include Harry Potter, Hermione Granger, Ron Weasley, Victor Crumb who also has an accessory of a shark piece to turn him into one as well as a mer person. And the final character shown in this set is one of those squid-like creatures that attacks Harry. Then in this set you do get three builds, the first one being a small build for a boat. Then the next two builds are actually two different sections which you can attach together. The first one being the watchtower part, then the next section is the underwater part. But as to the next part, this was probably the hardest part to do because there was a lot of trial and error due to the sizing of the set. So I had to try a number of different containers and just different ways to actually have the set look like it was underwater. And because of that, I had just all sorts of different shapes and sizes for containers to actually look like it was submerged underwater. But the one I eventually went for was this one here, but the only problem was I need to actually have something on the top to have the top half of the set displayed. So that's when I went for this one here to actually have it on top like that. But then it just looked way too tall to actually have all this half covered in water and then the set on the top. So that's when I then decided to actually use one of these plastic pockets and tape it to the container tight enough so that the set could sit on top of it. So now it's the moment of truth to see if it will hold the watchtower section of the build. So 
So now it's time to add the underwater section of the build. But by adding the underwater section of the build close enough to the container, you are still able to see the underwater section. So now the only thing left to do is fix a few sections up, but also add a bit of detail to it. So hope you guys did enjoy this video because I really did enjoy making this type of content and it was something I really enjoyed doing as well as it was just a really fun and interesting experience. Because when the set first came out I immediately knew I wanted to do an idea like this and to now have the set and actually do that idea was loads of fun and I would love to do more videos like this but apart from that i would definitely love to hear your thoughts and opinions down in the comments below and as always guys hope you guys did enjoy this video and continue to so goodbye